the Wings to Fly program has given thousands of young Kenyans an opportunity to acquire education. Your performance at the Mary University is something that we are very proud of. And I am confident that we will be more proud with your stewardship as Chancellor of the Open University of Kenya. I was very specific when I told uh, uh, C.S. Machogu on who the Chancellor should be. And it is because um, this is a very important institution. This is a bottom-up institution. This institution is going to give opportunity, access to very ordinary people. The people who ordinarily would not afford now have an opportunity to acquire university education from very remote places. An undeniable truth that may be said about the people of Kenya without any fear of contradiction is this, that regardless of the regional and socioeconomic distinctions that are used to describe us, we all want the same thing for ourselves, our families, and our nation. And we fiercely believe that we deserve equal access to the means and opportunities to actualize these aspirations. The rigorous nationwide journey of, the, of public convers, uh, consultations that we undertook, which set out the government's bottom-up economic transformation agenda speaks to this truth. This certainty persuaded us to incorporate into the agenda three critical and complementary principles. First, it was a priority for government to develop and strengthen political institutions and cultures which facilitate effective and inclusive national discourse that enable Kenya to define and articulate their aspirations in terms of what we believe in that should be public policy. Secondly, we prioritize the enhanced support for governance and administrative mechanisms that protect rights, guarantee liberty, safeguard dignity, and advance well-being at all times. Finally, we identified the urgent imperative for a development agenda which transforms every Kenyan's fundamental interest from that of expecting and demanding a share of the national development cake to one whereby all Kenyans are rallied to join the common enterprise of making a much bigger and richer national cake and are guaranteed to partake equitably. What I'm trying to say is the following. We've always had a conversation as a country about sharing, sharing positions, sharing this, sharing resources. But fundamentally, the conversation that we are now having, the policy interventions that we have recommended in our policy framework, including in our budget, is how not so much sharing what we have, but on how making sure that we bake a bigger cake. Yeah? And it begins with how we empower everybody to be able to participate in the baking of that bigger cake. And it starts with us arming everybody with the right education, giving everybody a chance at acquiring knowledge, and being empowered to be able to make meaningful contribution. And that is the reason this year had the largest budget in education in Kenya's history. 
these members of parliament may not know, but it was deliberate. 